Welcome to Halo Service Desk. Today we'll be running through how to create agents and also edit agent details. First thing you'll need to do when you log into your account is you need to head up to the configuration area over here then go to Teams and Agents and then to Agents once more. Then up here you can click New. This will be able to give you the ability to create a new person within the system. From here you can fill out relevant information so that be their username, this is their name title, you can pop in their email address as well, you can create their um, password, you can also give them a role as well, so we've covered roles in other videos, um, but essentially a role is a bunch of attributes attributed to a certain staff member within your uh, account, so this could be a customer service role, this could be a HR role, a sales role, whatever it may be, you can attribute a certain number of permissions to that role. So for the purpose of this, it would be used in a scenario where you don't want to have to kind of manually configure each individual permission. You would like to just kind of say, I want this person to be have the same roles as that person and stuff like that. Um, so it's a quick way to be able to give someone a, um, a quick role uh, permission set up. From here, you can fit in any other criteria. You can also choose the main role that they sit under as well. So if it's a support person, for instance, you'll be able to pop them into here. Give them their job title. Choose their working hours as well. So if, what, you know, if you have staggered working shifts, if you have international offices, if they're 24 hour response, whatever it may be, you can pop it in here and this will highlight the hours that they work. Also be applicable to SLAs as well. Once that's created, you can click back in if you want to. You can give them a, a profile picture. You can also clone other accounts as well as a first step. So if you want to just to kind of quickly copy someone else's account, you're able to do so. And from here, you can actually get an overview of people's different setups, different configurations within the system. So you can edit this all from here. You can choose what permissions they have, any sort of complications, and then you can start fitting this out. That's all I wanted to share in terms of today's video. Um, feel free to check out other guides we have on Halo Service Desk. Um, and if you want to, you can visit haloservicedesk.com.